Hello guys, welcome back on Dutch Motorsports. We are still on the Audi stand at the Paris Motor Show. Behind me, we have the old new SQ2. So it is a really nice car. We're gonna have a look at the outside and inside so you can really see what this car is about. So if we start with the front, we can recognize it is uh, S version of the Q2. We have that really more aggressive bumper here in the front. We have the black grille. Uh, we have that nice SQ2 logo here. And we also have that really nice blue paint, uh, really nice looking. I think really the car looking apart. We have the nice head headlights, which is common to the standard version. We have some nice wheels. I think they are 19 inches. We have also the nice looking brake caliper with the S logo on it. And here on the side we have also that nice stickering, the quattro sticker in black, which is which makes a really good contrast with the blue color of the car. And at the back we will find also that nice aggressivity we have that great looking bumper at the back and we have those nice exhaust tips glossy black exhaust tips uh, pretty big it looks really nice now in this, uh, in this small car So let's have a look at the inside. So here in the inside we have something similar to the new OED A1 but there are different elements like here we have the pop-up screen in the A1 it was in the dashboard and the design in the interior is less angular than the OEA one and we have some more comments here uh, for the screen you can have the touchpad here we also have that nice lighting which is within the the kind of plastic looking trim here Find it also here on the side. Looks pretty nice. It changes from from all the other models. We have the S steering wheel, which is looking really great here, with the pedal shifts here in the back. Really nice. We have the S Tronic here, transmission. S seats are also nice here, leather seats with double white stitching on the leather, looks just amazing. We have the sunroof here with the big one, looks really nice.
So guys, that was it for the SQ2. I hope you did enjoy it. Stay tuned and we're gonna have a lot of car to see now.